Hello traders, FS Collector here. Today is Wednesday, September 4th, and this is my recap of the top viewed videos of the day. And the pound US dollar came in number three today, so we're going to do a quick recap on the one hour time frame. If you'd like to see my full top down analysis on the pound dollar, make sure you check out the video linked at the end of this video over here. So we had that break of structure that I've been talking about on the pound dollar, which I think confirms that this one, two, three, four, five waves down is complete. I think this is a wave A of a bigger ABC crescent on like the daily time frame. If that's the case, then most likely we are in an ABC of wave B. So I'll be paying very close attention to the Fibonacci retracement levels. I would expect to see three waves up to maybe the 61, 78%, and then probably a nice Fibonacci bounce, a nice break of structure, showing us the question is over, and probably pushing down for that bigger wave C, potentially on Friday, because we have non-farm payroll on Friday. But tomorrow we have some pretty decent news also. We got some Aussie news later. We got uh, the governor of Australia speaking later on this evening. We also have construction PMI for the pound, probably not a good really that big of a market mover. Uh, we have the estimated non-farm payroll change, which is usually not a market mover either, but at the same time, we have unemployment claims, and we also have service PMI tomorrow, which is definitely a market mover, and on Friday, we get the big news, which is non-farm payroll, so we definitely got some things to uh, keep an eye out for these last couple of days of the week, for sure, and should cause some pretty good volatility in the markets, which is great news for us, because that's how we make our money. So anyways, don't forget to join my free Discord group, link down here in the corner, and as always, thank you and happy trading.